I'm Justine. And I'm Lou. And, and we're, we're Two Brooch, Brooch Girls. Girls. And today we're going to take you through some Brooch Speed Dating. We are going to explore 10 Australian makers in 10 minutes. Here, Here we, we go. go! The Makings of Miss Jones is a Boss Bay business based in Melbourne, Australia. She hand makes her brooches from different types of acrylic and she's well known for her portrait brooches such as this Marilyn brooch which is just stunning. Miss Jones also uses a special lacquer to give a very glossy 3D effect. Another type of portrait brooch is this one here which is Holly and Wild Thing and you can see the different acrylics used there. Miss Jones also did a range of Frida's. This is the Winter Frida and once again you can see the beautiful glitter and flat different types of acrylics used in this brooch. She's also well known for her sassy brooches and her tattoo style. This is Lady Luck, which comes with the gorgeous Hard Luck Dice. And then we've also got Man's Ruin and the Man's Ruin Glamour Edition. Such gorgeous brooches. You can buy from her website. The link will be below. Mox & Co. Mox & Co is a Brisbane-based company, a Boss Babe company, with Rachel at the helm. She designs and hand paints beautiful, quirky brooches, often with an Australiana theme. There's the Iced Vovo, a very typical Australian biscuit. And there's a Magpie and a Sturts Desert Pea from the Australiana range of last year, which are beautiful statement pieces. An elephant with this beautiful marbled acrylic and there's often little quirky bits and pieces. These are some ibis and in Australia we call these bin chickens. Have a look at her website, the link will be down below. Dear Arrow is a family run and operated business based in the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia. They're well known for their quirky and fun pieces that are based on vintage, nature and Australiana. So one of the pieces that they are quite well known for is their Diego. Diego is a dragon and this is an example of a baby Diego. This is a blue one and you can see the gorgeous um, marble and glitter acrylic that's been used. They're really well made pieces and you can see the maker mark on the back. Dear Arrow also do um, fun pieces like this cherry pie. I love the inlaid acrylic here and the cherries and just the contrast of the marble and the flat acrylic. It makes it a really lovely piece. Dear Arrow do special occasion brooches as well. So each year they have a Christmas release. This was a Christmas pud brooch from a few years ago and I love the little glitter detail on the top there and you can see it's a really classic piece. They also did last year make your own kit so you were able to get a kit and make it yourself. Check out the link below to go to their website to see what they have in stock. Peppy Chipette is a Melbourne based Boss Bay business run by Louisa Camille. She designs quirky brooches, often with animals. Here is Elsie the elephant with her gorgeous bouquet of tulips. Paisley Peacock with that beautiful glitter acrylic. Appley Ever After is a stunning red apple with that cute little worm. And one of my favourites is the Lucky Duck Trio of ducks with their gorgeous glitter acrylic. That's the third one. Check out her website on the link below. Minxie Vixen is for anyone who loves 1940s and 1950s glamour. They actually specialise in making custom loungewear and sleepwear. So today we're going to have a look at their brooches. They actually design and make hand cut laser acrylic brooches and also some brooches made from wood. This is called Australian Mistletoe and you can see here it's got some lovely details like the little striped string and the different contrasting acrylics. They also make a range of mini brooches. So this tiny little Santa hat is actually a brooch and it's fantastic because you can pair this with lots of different brooches and basically make anything that you're wearing festive. Another great little mini brooch that they did was the coal brooch, the lump of coal. And once again, this is great paired with lots of different Christmas brooches. Have you been naughty or have you been nice? Check out the website in the link below. 
Peggy Walker is an artist um, based in Cairns, Queensland. She hand draws, hand paints and resin coats her brooches and finishes them off with a hand drawn foil, gold foil line. Here are a couple here, coffee and tea. Beautiful size. We have quirky lips. Spots and stripes, the Christmas gnomes. And my favourite is a teeny tiny chameleon. Just cute to put with lots and lots of other brooches. Check out her website on the link down below. Switchblade Made is another Boss Bay business based in Melbourne, Australia. She is known for her quirky, fun statement pieces, which are handmade and assembled from laser cut acrylic. So one of the brooches that I want to show you today was her pomegranate brooch. This brooch is just stunning. And what I wanted to really point out with Switchblade made brooches is the level of detail in each brooch. So with this pomegranate, each one of these seeds was actually hand placed. So it was a hand seeded brooch and lots of her brooches feature this level of detail. So they really are little wearable pieces of art. You've also got the mirror acrylic with the etched detail at the top and you can see this gorgeous ripply glitter resin. She does use a range of resins and acrylics to give her brooches a truly unique feel. Check Switchblade Made out in the link below. Tantalising Treasures is a Queensland based company, family run with Lex at the helm. She designs cute quirky brooches from a range of different themes including fantasy inspired brooches like this purple glitter hat, these lovely pieces and animals beautiful glittery cheeky chameleon and this couple of elephants in two different colorways and of course special occasion brooches like this fabulous Christmas tree. Lex is also known for her Dark Alice collection. Check out her website on the link below. Winter's Heart is another Boss Bay business based in Australia. It's run by Lynn who uses her own hand-drawn creations as well as licensed artworks to make quirky statement jewellery. This includes brooches, earrings and necklaces. I'm going to show you two pieces today that I have of her brooches. The first one is from the 2019 Strawberry Fields collection. Winter's Heart is well known for the detail in their brooches, so you can see here if I turn to the side the way that the acrylic has actually been layered to give a 3D effect. I also love the yellow backing here because it means when the light hits this brooch, the yellow actually shows through the little holes in the strawberries. So this is a really gorgeous brooch. The other piece that I wanted to share with you was from the Christmas 2020 collection. And these are called, or this brooch is called Christmas Heels. I love the different acrylics that have once again been used and layered here to give that 3D effect. So we have the glitter on the shoes, we have the clear acrylic with the etching here, and then we actually have the glossy glittery bows on the front. Check out her website in the link below. Fractured Lace is an Australian based business run by Kat who love, has a strong sense of whimsy and is an aspiring storyteller and does that through her brooches. She often releases collections. These brooches come from the Picnic collection and when they were released they actually came with a story. She also does brooches from special occasions like this stunning lime green Halloween bow with the little skeleton feature there and Christmas brooches such as Father Christmas here with his unique teal colouring and the letter to Santa also in that pink and teal colouring. It's lovely to see different colours. Check out her website on the link below. Thanks for joining us for our first brooch speed dating. 
Remember, if you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up and also hit that red subscribe button to find out about upcoming video and content. Bye, Bye everyone. everyone.